good on you. Do I know you? Oh, hi, I'm Candice Oh, my God, you look amazing. I was like such a proud mama. I got, you'll see it all. Oh my God. I tagged you and everything and I've been bragging on you all day. So I'm super oh excited. Oh my God, thank you. So, have you, like, have you taken a breath since you've been? No, I like couldn't even breathe in the car. <laughs> is it the dress or is it the anticipation? It's the dress for sure. Okay, okay, but you know, pain is beauty. So we got this. You look beautiful. Thank you so much. Thank you. So tell me about Anna. Tell me why you're so in love with her and why you know that America's going to fall in love with her. You know what? I think she is so so unapologetically herself and I, I think I've said that in every interview but I really stand true, stand true to that statement she's strong she's just herself she knows who she is and she's okay with that and she's just like you know what I just want everybody else to be okay with that too yeah so walk me through the process from the audition to like once you got on set because you guys really do seem like a family when yes, yeah it's obnoxiously like that <laughs> on and off set like there is no lies guys um yeah so you know it's so funny because my first First, well, for my first audition was just alone, right? I went in, read with the um, with the casting director, but I will say that winning the room mm -hmm. is more important than booking the audition because I came back to this room maybe three months after um, to book this, and prior to that, I was up for I was very close to another film, mm -hmm. but I booked the room, right? I made that connection, and then I, I had the opportunity to do this, and she really fought for me, and you know it was it was easy but when I did the audition the chem read with the guys mm -hmm. I think that's when we were like oh we got this like I walked outside not knowing who they were and I was like hey y'all want to read and they were like yeah and we were like okay cool it was just super easy and that's exactly how it is on set too it's just such a family environment and so supportive men and women combined yeah well it definitely reads especially from the trailer obviously we haven't seen it, it comes out tomorrow but you all have gotten such high reviews like today you had Rolling Stone New York Times LA Times I mean, I'm missing a couple too so and uh, the, overall it's been overly positive how does that feel going that's amazing it's super encouraging I mean I feel like we all love what we did and we're we love our show you know what I mean and we're like so we're so proud of it and we're so proud of each other and I feel like we we gave each other the space and and like the support and the safety within the set to just really dive into our characters without judgment or like concern um, and I think that really made it that made it the best. I don't know. I, I, I really can't say enough about them and about the process and just like everybody involved. So last question. Obviously, we're really proud that we, Latinx representation, yeah. everything. What's the one thing that you hope audiences take away once they binge this show tomorrow? Because I know they're not going to be stopped watching. I think the one thing that I hope you take away is that this is for everybody. Like, Latinos are representing for sure, which we're really proud of. But this is for everybody. I mean, I'm from down south, so I hope everybody can relate. Any little girl, especially for Ana, um, my sister sister was just like I want to be Anna you know she she came to set one day and she's like I didn't even see you I saw her and I was like I want other little girls to know like you can fight for your dream keep going it hurts and there's gonna be tears but you got this because I am foolproof of that for sure awesome thank you so much I'm so proud of you so much friend